Welcome to Model Lessons in Mathematics, Elementary Science and Technology, Social Studies, Creative Arts, Physical Education for Lower Primary Grades, produced by Rwanda Education Board in collaboration with the World Bank. Well done. Hello children. This is Cha Henry. We are back for our physical education, PE in short form. That is physical education. Uh, in most cases, when you are going for this physical education, it is advisable to have what we call warm-up activities. As we said, the importance of these warm-up activities is to prepare your body for a bigger activity. Because the moment you rush for a big activity when you have not had these warm-up activities, at times you can collapse, you can faint, you end up, you get tired so fast. So it's better to first warm yourself. For example, we have this one of running on the spot. Uh, when we are running on the spot here, there is no need of using a lot of energy. No, you do it slowly, uh, like this. You run on the spot. Run on the spot. You can increase. You can go down. You can increase. You can go down. One, two, 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 one, two. Now uh, you can stretch. You can swing. And normally when you are doing this, make sure that you are far from a friend. Normally when you are near each other, you can have the collision. You end up slapping someone in the process of swinging. So, come like this. Move on. Move on. Move on. Move on. Make sure that at least you space yourselves very well. We can have this one of kicking in the space. Kick. Mm. Kick in the space. Mm. Yes, in the space. In the space. You can even box the air. This, 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 this. In doing this, definitely you are preparing the body for the next activity. Uh, today's activity is about throwing of the ball. Throwing of the ball. There's a, a game which we call variable. Then how do we throw our ball? There is what we call serving of the ball. Normally when in, uh, unfortunately we don't have the uh, variable caught right away here, but we are going to improvise. Then, normally when we are having this variable, uh, we have someone who serves the ball first. So this is our, uh, the tactic we want to, at least to develop today. Then, of course, we shall be developing part by part. Then later, we can have the whole game. And we, shall, we are able now to compete seriously. So can we have, my people, can we have this coat here? Try to be fast. Let's have our coat here. Then we see how we can be able to throw this ball. Make the coat. Try to this side. Hey. OK. This one. Ah, ah, do like this. So this is now our court. Try to raise it a little bit up. Uh -huh. I don't mind much. So this is the, this is now my court. Now, make sure when you are here, you try to, you make sure you serve and it closes the net. I'm all about, our intention is to first learn how we can serve the ball and close 
the net. Can you now start? But now, always, uh, this is like the, this is like the instructional tool that we use. After hearing the whistle, when I blow the whistle, we'll be able to serve. Uh-huh, can you now? First wait, uh, not necessary to bring it back, but also get it, then serve also. We are now on the point of serving, and it closes the net. Okay, first throw it back to him, first throw it back to him. Serve and make sure the ball closes the net. Uh, now that's wrong. It has not closed the net. It has not closed the net. The ball should close the net. Bring it back. And uh, I think you should use your always, the hand you always use. If you have you use left always, it's okay. But now use the right hand. Use the right hand. Make sure it closes the net. Move on, move on. Uh huh. Good. Throw it to him. Uh, more practice, because they say practice makes perfect. That was good. No, that's wrong. Give him back. Make sure it closes the net. It must close the net. That's wrong. That's wrong. Now. We are going to change. We are going to change. Go the other side. Come this side. Come this side. Now, make sure in what you are doing, you make sure that the ball closes the net. This is what we are interested in. Can it close the net? Uh-huh. Good. Pass it down. Again. Good. However, you should not use a lot of force. Don't use a lot of force. Normally, at times this work, or when we are doing this, it's a matter of the tactic, but not the force. More practice, more practice. Make sure it closes the net. Uh-huh. Move on. Move on. That's nice. That's nice. Uh-huh. Bring the ball. Bring the ball. I want to do as, uh, make sure you bring the ball as fast as you can so that you can have more practice. Good. Let the ball come. Good. Good. I like this. Now, you go back that side. Come here for more practice. I've seen now, at least with this practice, I'm sure at least you have learned something also. Uh huh. Move on. That's wrong. I've said it must go on top of the net. That's nice. Let the ball come. That's one. I want 10 times. Two. So your pass is when it goes up the net. I want, can you do 10 when it is uh, three? And we shall, I'm now going to bring it out and I say who is the best. Four. Bring very fast. Sorry, sorry, move on. Five, no. Now you are starting from zero. Bring, bring, bring. Make sure you can go to ten. One, two, without, so that you can be the best. Uh -huh. Please, move on. It has passed this one. Provided it closes the net, I give you a point. Very fast. Two. Be fast. Three. Be fast. Be fast. Four. Be fast. Five. Be fast. We want ten. No, you are, you are wrong. Come this side. Go back. Can you move to ten when it is passing? Maybe I reduce. It seems ten. There are very many. I can reduce. Uh -huh. Make sure it is passing. One. That's one. Make sure you close the ball very fast. Try to be fast. Two. Good. Three. 
Move, move on, move on. Five, four. Four, be fast, be fast. Ah, you have failed. Okay, let's stop there, let's stop there. Thank you so much. In other words, when you are doing this, that means you are very good at shooting. Shooting, that is serving. In volleyball, we call it serving. The moment you failed to serve and close the net, that shows you have already failed the beginning. That's, that means you have failed the beginning. So through doing this, this is one part. Definitely we shall have more parts, then later we shall be able to have the whole game, the whole game of our volleyball. Like any other game in our physical education, when we are done with that game, there is what we call cool down activities. Cool down, if we are, because we have been involving uh, serving here, running up and down, we have to make sure that we cool down. We cool down our body, then we are able to go back to our class. Uh, here we can have, you can relax, you can relax by bending one side, like stretching your body. You can stretch this side, come back this side, backwards, in front, sideways, sideways, backwards, in front. Then we can have this uh, breathing in, breathe in, in, out. Breathe in, in, out. You can also come down here. And come down here. You stretch. You stretch. You relax. You relax. Make sure you don't force yourself. Don't force the body. Don't use a lot of energy. This is just relaxing. And this is what we call cool down activities after our game. Yes, uh, I think with all that that we have looked at, thank you so much. We meet next time. Bye.